Remove the door to the crankcase. Turn the crosshead down far enough to give access to the piston rod stuffing box and the screws for the piston rod. Release the stuffing box by removing the innermost screws for stuffing box flange. Remove the screws from the piston rod. Mount the two distance pieces on the piston rod foot to protect the lower scraper ring and to guide the stuffing box. Make a scratch mark in liner and piston cleaning ring to ensure the correct mounting. Remove the piston cleaning ring. Carefully remove any wear ridges at the top of the cylinder liner. See procedure 9031. Turn the crosshead towards top dead center while checking that the stuffing box lands correctly on the distance pieces. Turn to top dead center. The top of the piston is now free of the cylinder liner. Clean the lifting groove of the piston crown Mount the lifting tool in such a manner that the two fixed claws of the tool fit into the lifting groove of the piston. Fit the third adjustable claw and tighten it up against the stop of the tool. See data 1021. Lift the piston out of the cylinder liner. Lower the piston rod foot and stuffing box through the opening in the platform. Place the two halves of the support around the piston rod and secure the two halves with screws. Land the piston on the support. Remove the lifting tool from the piston crown. Place a cover over the opening for the piston rod stuffing box in the bottom of the cylinder liner. See procedure 9031.